what's absolutely incredible Jordan points out is that there is there, think about it there's 8 billion people on the planet look at what we've created just have a look look at what technology this that like there are so many ways things can fall apart or fail to work together and it's always wounded people who are holding it together like think about it if anyone's fortunate enough to be in a rare period of grace and health personally then you probably know somebody who's going through some type of uh, crisis with their health yet we all prevail and continue to do difficult and effortful tasks to hold ourselves and their families and our society together and this is miraculous this Jordan puts this is miraculous like it's often wounded people who are, as I said before who are holding it together and they deserve so much more credit for what they're doing and admiration it's an ongoing miracle of fortitude and perseverance. People are so tortured by the limitation of and constraint of being that I'm amazed they ever act properly or look beyond themselves at all. But enough do so that we have central heat and running water and infinite computational power and electricity enough for everyone to eat and even the capacity to contemplate the fate of broader society and nature, terrible nature itself. All that complex machinery that protects us from the freezing and start Freezing and starving and dying from lack of water tends unceasingly towards malfunction through entropy and it is only the constant attention of careful people that keeps it working so unbelievably well. Some people degenerate into the hell of resentment and the hatred of being, but most refuse to do so despite their suffering and disappointments and losses and inadequacies and ugliness and again, that is a miracle for those with eyes to see it. It's nothing short of incredible. When I first read this, I'm like, it's amazing.